Yes. Uh, in Nigeria, we are approaching another electoral year. By 2023, we are expected to vote in another president, some states, governors, House of Rep members, senators, and what have you. Now, the leaders, our politicians are getting ready. They are saving money. They are inflating contracts from where they will get the money to buy your votes. Now, the money that is meant for the development of the country, the money that is meant for building of infrastructures, the money that is meant to be invested to create jobs for the team, you'd look at 130 million Nigerians are below the age of 30 years. That is a teeming youth population. The, now we are complaining of hike in dollars, hike in prices of commodity. We are complaining of so many things wrong with the country. Infrastructural decay, high level of poverty, no jobs for youth and all that. They are not fixing the problem. The money that is meant to fix the problems are being saved kept aside to buy votes and who is going to sell the votes you 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 that guy listening to me you are the one going to sell your votes you sell your vote for 500 naira for a thousand naira the share sold for you that is going to increase your bp the share two three cups of rice and you collect they have succeeded in impoverishing you so that you can have no value so that your votes can be cheap when your vote is cheap if it is one billion they are dispersing for buying your votes it will go round you can see your foolishness you sell your votes your religion doesn't tell you that look I shouldn't sell my votes. I mean, common sense. Even in countries that work by common sense, not the documents of religion, they are reasoning better than you. So don't you see the failures in your gatherings, in your worship and all that? So a lot of things is wrong fundamentally with our foundation. Our culture, our practices, our norms, something is fundamentally wrong with it. Who is going to build the country? Who is going to build Nigeria? Who won't correct Nigeria? It is you. It has to be you. It should be you. It must be you. Why are you selling your votes? Now, there are strategies on ground. Even the electronic transmission or result they are talking about cannot be trusted 100% because human beings are still operating it. What would they do? Some of them will position HK. They position hackers to hack into the system, into the servers, and change results. It's possible. So we cannot trust, be it electronic transmission or result or non electronic transmission or result, whatever system they are going to use. Human beings are in charge. And that system is vulnerable to rigging. But the main thing that can change our electoral system, that can change our political system for the better, it's if you stop selling your votes. You, that woman, that woman with five children, you, that guy, that young guy who is jobless, you, 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 that babe, that babe, where they hang around uh, joints looking for urgent 2K, urgent 3K, why selling your votes? The condition you are in is your country that is responsible. Your country puts you in that condition. So why are you selling your vote? So selling your vote doesn't solve your problem. It doesn't help you. It doesn't help anybody. So we need to look at ourselves. We need to do internal renovation. Correct our own errors. We are the problem of the country. 
Everything Nigeria needs has been given to us. We have over 180 something cubic meters of surface water. We have over 40 billion uh, barrels of crude oil. We have over 300 and something trillion cubic feet of liquefied natural gas. We have arable land in all the nook and crannies of Nigeria land area. We have favorable weather conditions. We have over 200 million people that can be trained with skills to deliver Nigeria. We have an irrigated Y-shaped tributary linking northwest, southwest, um, northeast, down, flowing down a third into the Atlantic Ocean. And it has delta, it has creeks rich in oil and gas resources. What is it that Nigeria doesn't have? It's located right on the angle of the trigger of the revolver, which Africa symbolizes. So what does Nigeria want? Nigeria has everything. Nigeria has got everything it needs to be there. But Nigeria is not there because of you. The leadership, the followership, the electorates, everybody has failed this country. And the failure of this country is a failure of your religion, the failure of wherever you belong, your tribe, your culture, your religious leaders, your traditional leaders are all responsible for this failure. So you think about it. That vote, that PVC you are holding, what are you going to do with it? Thank you.